Oh man. That does be bringing me back. Oh, this tile screen. Hey there, everyone. This is Alcow. Legend of Zelda is a video game I played a lot in my childhood. It was extremely, very much a game of my formative years. And it's a game I played at length with my dad uh, many years ago. Prince Darkness Ganon, in quotes. I guess <laughs> it's a nickname. I units. Alright, you mean we're only concerned about one third of the Triforce. It's just kind of weird. Uh, heart, heart! Yeah, it's a game uh, I played with my dad, like, like for quite a bit. Like, uh, a while ago, I think like last summer, I was talking with my dad, right? And uh, I asked him if there was a game you'd want me to play on my channel, because he does watch my videos. Hi. Hey. Um, uh, you know, and I asked him, you know, if there was a game you want me to play, and he thought about it a little bit, and he ultimately gave this as the answer, Legend of Zelda. So when uh, it was given to me as a royal choice, I did not look up the manuals for detail. <laughs> I decided, no, yeah, this is the chance. I'm taking it. Sup, y'all. That looks like a rapier to sword in the logo, not the actual Master Sword. Register your name. I don't want to do that. All right. We got flashing letters. So, important things to know. I know this game. Uh, then you press this. There we go. Register and uh, I know The Legend of Zelda. Uh, I've beaten this game like 50 times. I haven't touched it in a while though, so there might be things I don't super remember. But um, I'm very aware of this game. I have never even touched nor seen a playthrough of the second quest. And we're gonna do both! So, I don't know what that's gonna be. Oh, right. Yeah, no diagonals. Just a little elf! Bimmy the elf! Motor skills! Alright, so like, I'm, I'm going to try to be considerate to people who have never played this game, because they're mind me. And so I ask people in the crowd to extend the same consideration. Uh, but yeah, there is a second quest, and like, I kinda know what it's about, but I've never played it. So anyway, check it out, Legend of Zelda, you're using and playing an elf. There's octopus in the mountains, and you shoot them in the face with your sword. Your sword, a little like, wooden sword that old man, grandpa found. Uh, it shoots lasers. It's pretty good. So, you can do that. You can attack these people. Press start, you got inventory. Press B button for this! Sweet! You also got a pause button. I don't know why. And here's this door. It's a rectangle. This is all the great things we can buy. I can't afford anything. Alright, I know where to go, but I'm just taking a bit of a detour for no real reason, nor gains. How's it going? So, uh, yeah, Legend of Zelda. Uh, it's like I said, I know this game, but it's been a hot minute since I've actually played. So, uh, there might be some, you know, like, so just sort of reordering myself time. But that's fine. That's okay. Check it out! There's trees! And also, oh yeah, there we go. And there's a fairy inside this octopus. It's pretty weird. I don't really- uh, Once upon a time, I was planning in all of the Zeldas until I realized I didn't want to make all the things anymore. Check out the sweet ocean beach. Whoa, check it out. It's an underground thing. Pretty good. It has money inside. I will take that money. And, uh, oh yeah, the blue ones are stronger. That's right, everyone knows that. Why are there so many fairies? Stop it. Oh, there's a bomb. Those are good. There we go. Press B for bomb. And across this bridge, there's a tree. Inside that tree's an octopus. But more importantly, there's the first dungeon, level one. And if I press that, you get a map of some kind. Alright. Like, I feel like a lot of the iconography you can see more or less speaks for itself, probably, kinda. There's a key, you can use it. The key, if we find Ganon's door, we can just like put a big old scratch on it, it's gonna be great. Uh, but yeah, check it out, Zelda. <laughs> like, 
for a lot of you people in the audience just looking at that like wow you made so many speedrunning mistakes already and I'm like good I'm not doing it on purpose but I'm not doing it on not purpose either there's a clock the power of the clock mysteriously disappears from the series but yeah uh yeah so there we go hi hey how's it going this is a game you use a pretty little elf and you go around and you hit things monsters until they all die. And the game really does incentivize us just hitting things until they die forever. It is a cruel world we inhabit in. Check out all these skeletons. Eh, yeah, there we go. Because I'm at full heart, I can throw lasers again. That's just an elf thing. Like, it makes sense if you consider that. Alright, I'm gonna go here, which I believe is where I don't want to go, but it's where I can go. Check it out, there's a bowl on the ground. Aw, oh, the thing bit me. So you get the compass, aka the item that the Zelda franchises keeps trying to find a way to make good. What it does is it adds a little flashing spot up there, which is your goal, the, the piece of the Triforce that... Zelda rudely split into a bunch of pieces and then sending her her elf to go and get wow I'm getting destroyed by a bat that's happening movement is I wouldn't call it rough but um it's awkward a little it's stiff here we get little tiny slimes they're adorable I'm pretty sure that little enemies never have drops wow first death but you saw the, the speed it moves at, right? Alright, so this is what happens. To avoid damaging game info saved. That's a sentence. Part fragment. Hold in reset button as you turn power off. As far as I'm aware. Dying is the only way to save the game, I think. Or you use a button combination on controller 2. That's right. But it's good that I've died because here we can see important info. Important data. I still have- I'm here, I'm at the castle. I have all the money I got. I got all the keys I picked up and I spent. Like, I even still have the, um, the thing, the, the compass. Basically, you know, the game pretty aggressively auto say Well, every time you get a thing, basically. Well, every time a, a state in the game changes. That gets saved if you happen to die afterwards. Yeah, tiny enemies though, like they're just not really worth fighting. So why am I fighting that guy then, huh? Why why am I doing that? Well, because I got a laser and it's easy, but also important mechanic! Whoa, push a block to get a thing happen, and you need to have make sure there's no enemy in the rooms. Alright. Eastmost peninsula is the secret! Thanks, buddy! That's very English of you. I mean, it is. It is an English sentence. It's not super coherent, but there's worse. All right, there's a sweet piece of paper there. So I'm just gonna sit here and, whoa, and throw lasers all day. Yeah, you can only have one sword laser at a time in the universe. Check it out, it's a map. If you press the button, you can compare with the map below. This is the temple of the eagle. Kind of makes a bird shape, except one of its wings is a bit bigger. Don't worry about it. You got a key I'm gonna need at some point, probably. I'm gonna attack you from the other side of this river. I want the money, though. Like, we s you saw that one shop I entered. Prices are exorbitant. It is a cruel world for little elves that were summoned forth in the middle of nowhere. Without no economy or anything, really, whatsoever. Did I not get anything here? I guess not! I guess it's later! I don't know! I got a key, I'm gonna go inside this door. Whoa, check it out! Oh, okay, it's death trap! Wee! They don't go very fast, but they're there! And then you make a little conch sound. Oh, check it out! It's a one-string guitar! Alright! Gonna be careful around the bats. There you go. I did it! I got it! And we got the sweet room that was copied from Binding of Isaac, too. That's pretty neat. And probably pretty good little, uh, uh, Easter egg, as it's called. Oh, yeah, so, I mean, jokes aside, it's a bow. 
I cannot move my cursor over to it though, so it's probably not working. Who've ever seen an elf use a bow anyways? That's just a completely ridiculous notion. Get out of here with that nonsense. We're not listening. We don't want to hear it. Sometimes, I don't know, the... It's not super, like... Moving like this, real smooth. But top to bottom, it's like all hitchy. I don't know if the real console is like that. I, I haven't seen one of those in a while. Wow, just throwing bananas at me? Making my sirens beep? That's very rude. I'll have your banana, please. It's the boomerang! Check it out! We See, boomerang can go diagonal all at once. I can't. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> so welcome to the room with the dots. There's a key here and there's a hand that pops out of the wall. It's pretty weird. You don't want to be grabbed, probably. I don't know. Uh, you can hear, like, roar. Fantastic roar in the background. It's pretty good. It's my favorite sound effect. Oh, wait. Uh, uh, hand! I, why did I shout hand? I got a clock. Hands and clock. Not the same! Check it out! I'm somewhere! Alright. So, whoa! It's Aquamantis! That's that guy's name. If you don't have... Yeah, see, he doesn't care. Oh, okay, I might die to this boss. I mean, I died to a little gel on the floor, so... That's like a full-on dragon. So that's the sailing lakes. It's fun. <laughs> Dang it! My little stab! Oh. Okay, you need to hit the head. But that's... That's where the bolts come from. I don't want to mess with that. Uh, okay. No, yeah, it is the head. Got it. No! It's the head! It's the important part. That's right, I got all the hands money. Alright, this time I got beam lasers from my wooden sword, so uh, uh, the experience is going to be slightly different than getting here without the ability to shoot light beams from your wooden sword. Slightly different impact that makes. Get a heart! Yeah! I'm going to eat this unicorn dragon's heart. And here's a triangle, and here we go. That's a game loop. Pretty short, simple, and sweet, right? Should be no problem. Whoa, we can appear from a cloud. Uh, except I don't want to die, so I guess I'll... Quote, unquote, save. The next time when I reload, I'll just walk back here in this exact state. Don't worry about it. <laughs> 